All right, and as that temperature continues to go mm -hmm. up and down in recent weeks, farmers are feeling, local farmers, feeling the full force of Mother Nature. Their crops are on the front line in the battle against the weather. Some say if this continues, it could affect their entire harvest. Our Tom Kowalski spoke with farmers today about some of the issues. Tom. Mike and Eva, with temperatures up to 80 degrees last week and then this week, just yesterday, back down to snowy and cold conditions, you and I are the only ones confused as to what Mother Nature is doing these days. Farmers are concerned as to what their plants are thinking of this and are, are concerned that it could affect their harvest. From high temperatures and sunshine last week to cold snowy skies this week, some farmers are on edge about what this could mean for their crops. You can do everything you think's right as far as doing a good job of growing it in five minutes, Mother Nature can screw it all up. John Mason of Mason Farms says the recent changes in weather could be disastrous for his harvest. When they bud out and then it gets, when it gets warm like last week for such a long period, a day or two isn't bad, but a whole week to 10 days is, is trouble. And what happens is the buds start growing on everything like this uh, twig here. This is a grape twig. And what will happen is if all of a sudden we get some 28, 25, 30 degree weather, it could freeze them. But other farmers, like Sam Best of Lakeview Wine Cellars, says as long as the change isn't too drastic, he's not overly concerned about his crop. The changes haven't really hurt us very much, I don't think, at this point in time. Uh, as it goes on and more of the buds are out a little bit farther and we get a hard freeze, then that's going to hurt a little bit, but grapevines have a secondary bud, so the, the primary bud might get frozen, but the secondary bud will come out. You get a lot less crop that way, and the quality isn't probably as good as the primary bud, but you're not going to be left high and dry. And Bess says, depending on the summer season, it could be beneficial. We get the proper amount of rain during the summer and then the nice warm days and cold nights in the fall and that brings the sugar up in the grapes and makes them better for harvest. We're going to take what Mother Nature is going to give us and we're going to make the best of it. Now farmers say they typically don't have to worry about the weather heating up this early in the season since the lake usually keeps things pretty cool but this year, with this year's mild winter they'll be feeling the effects for months to come. Tom Kowalski. Hearing news now.